halfway through the year and that can only mean one thing. 2000 Trees Festival! This lovely small festival happens in the beautiful area of the Cotswolds and it is probably one of the most chilled festivals I've ever been to. Heading for my seventh time this year, it's crazy to see how the festival has grown over the years. I always have a fun time at this festival so let's get going to 2000 Trees. Good morning everyone. It is currently like around the 5am time, but we're off to 2,000 trees. Yeah, I'm about to leave. My brain's not working because it's the morning. Uh, I'm gonna go pick up Charlotte and then I'm gonna head to trees. We're gonna go buy Mackies as well because I've got to have a morning Mackies. Traditional. Yeah, now so trees actually started yesterday. I couldn't go yesterday, unfortunately we sucked, but we're going early today, so we're doing that. Anyway, I'm, it's currently like, I need to go in like, I think five minutes. Yeah, I need to go in five, like literally be leaving in five minutes. So let's get going. Ooh. Right, we made it to Charlotte, so we've got to get her stuff in the car and then we can head off and get Mackie's. Of course, you have to have some cat fun time before going to a festival. You know. You know. Right, we need to attempt to Tetris everything in. So, yeah. If we, there's room behind the seats. Yeah, there's only these two special yeah. bags, so. Yeah. Right, if we, yeah. There's always room behind the seats, so we just chuck everything behind the seats. Okay. Do you want your pillow with you? <laughs> uh, nah, for all that. <laughs> my maternity pillow. <laughs> Hello, uh, could I get a um, sausage and egg McMuffin? Yep. Um, a hash brown and a Diet Coke. <laughs> and then could I also get the Mighty McMuffin meal as well, please? Brown sauce or ketchup? Um, or ketchup for me. And then. Oh, wait, wait, um, wait, is this the Mighty McMuffin? Yeah. Oh, the Mighty McMuffin, I mean, brown sauce on the Mighty McMuffin. And I want a Coke too. Yep. And a Coke, full fat. Full fat. And full fat Coke. Anything else? Um, that's it, thank you. Um, and then could I get ketchup on my double sausage and egg? No. A coke, coke on my sausage and egg got muffin. Yeah. Not coke, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Double 68, cheers. Yep, yeah. awesome, thank you. Cheers. Awesome, thank you. I need a shot of me, like, reaching across <laughs> you. Did the entire thing. One for you. Awesome. One night Awesome. Right. Uh, grab the squiggly thing. Uh, diet coke. coke, diet coke. Is that everything? I think I'm not sure. So we've got mighty muffin, sausage McMuffin, two hash browns, yeah. Yep. Awesome. <laughs> 
I'm, I'm guessing that's everything. Yeah. <laughs> They're like, cool, get, get out. Yeah. I'm like, they didn't say anything. I was just like, like eh. <laughs> right. to trees, to trees. Trees! To trees. <laughs> as well and it was like honey you gotta park in general and i'm like boo excuse me boo tree do you not know who i am i'm press i'm gonna run you down oh, see there's a silver one just down here yeah there's a space there so just do okay. find that silver one okay i'll follow you down all right all right where there's a space by a silver one apparently behind is there or no by oh there it is the ah Nice. Yeah, That's good because then you're like kind of easy to find because you know you're yeah, on the Yeah, we're like on the, the path, which makes it so much easier. But I'm gonna just. Tell me which cars are from yesterday. Yeah. Most of these will all be from yesterday. There we go. And we're right by the path. Okay. This is this is good. Oh, wait. I'm gonna move forward just a bit. So we've made it to trees. We're now gonna unpack the car and start packing up trolley so we can do the long walk to our camp. I don't even know where we're camping yet. That's the thing. I don't even know how far we've got to go up the hill to camp. The Yay. other side. Oh, so much walking. Download, I think it's going to be the shortest walk we've had this year. Right, so we need to get, I need to get my trolley out, which is there. So we need to get... Sorry. All right. I've got my diet coat, but I'm not going to, to carry it with everything. So. Yeah. Yeah. Right. So. We should be able to do that in a second trip. Right. Oh, bollocks. I need to bungee cord it all together, don't I? <laughs> You can tell it's the morning. I'm like, I don't know what I'm doing right now. <laughs> oh, trust me, when we when we when we found a place, we set up camp. We're having a sit down and a drink and like a chill and a fag and stuff before we like head over festival entrance over there. Ooh. It's so whimsical. I know. It's not that whimsical. Stop spoiling everything! Today's first festival is rose tinted glasses. <laughs> okay, it's amazing. We're going to go into a magical fairyland. Yay! It's where it's like, is next weekend when we go to Fantasy Forest. Yeah, true. Where, like, all the pathways are lined with like twinkle lights and stuff. Oh, that sounds nice. And then we've got the big fucking hill. <sighs> Right, this is this is the bit where we've got to just be careful with the trolley because it doesn't have brakes. You are the brake. 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 It's fine. Yep. Seven fifty nine a.m. Well, so we've just made it to the queue. They haven't opened yet. We've got about like a few minutes, and then we can go in and go and find somewhere to set up camp. A little longer than a few minutes later. Alright, that was a pain in the ass, but we've managed to get a, find a big enough spot for our tents and our gazebo, so we're going to start putting them up. Right, we have finished setting up our tents. There is one. And there is another. Unfortunately, I'm losing... I've lost two poles of the gazebo, which might not have been in there to begin with because it's my dad's. So we have got, we've got no gazebo, which sucks. So we are a slave to the elements if we uh, if, it, if it starts raining or it's too sunny. Uh, but we're gonna have a sit down and chill for a little bit um, before we do our second run. But luckily now we know where we're camped and how far we've got to go, so it's not too bad. Okay. 
Cheers. Right, we are now going to go do our second run. Oh wow, look at the, that's the, I think that's the carrot with the camper vans as well. So yeah, we're going to go do our second run now. And then we'll be all set up. Right, we have done our second trip. One sec, just got to check the car's locked. Yep, it's locked. Right, second trip. And then we're going to head back now. We're going to plod along. But we've got everything. And then we're going to... Yeah, we're going to get back to camp. Finish setting up. Make sure our homes are ready for the next few days. This is the easy bit. Going downhill. <laughs> We're going to have to carefully manoeuvre it down anyway. So I think if I control the handle and then we both kind of stand at the side to just kind of yeah. very slowly take it down. Oh. We are hot sweaty messes but we made it back to camp. A uh, big thank you to Raj for helping us on the last little bit because um, uh, we were absolutely fucking shattered uh, I'm not a very fit person my own fault but I'm not a very fit person but we're going to have a sit and a chill have a, like a de-stress and then we're going to get up and then we're going to get ready I think a few inches later right so we've all got ready and now we're off to have a little explore go get our wristbands as well I need to get, I've got to go down the right hand lane to get my press stuff and then <laughs> you can try you can try we, we can do this but yeah we're gonna go have a wonder show charlotte around the whole site yay and yeah we're gonna see what's crackalacking around yay right we've got our wristbands Woo! and yeah so um that's the cave that's the Axiom. I like the big size. Yeah. And then we'll head down to the main arena. So, Silent Disco Headphones Merch and Bar. And oh, they've got toilets down that way instead. Hey there, my trees sign. I think they're home somewhere. down and check out the press area to see if they have wi-fi and then just have a wander in the press area oh, oh. <laughs> why did i go back yeah. i don't know oh i swear i'm getting stupid by the day so this is the press area right we just have the check of the press area they do have wi-fi so that is something that I can go steal for myself when I need to like upload stuff, which is good to know. I need to oh I need to do some real stuff as well. Yeah. Um, but yeah, we're gonna go check out the forest stage and the word stage now. Hey everyone, I'm running to Kieran and he is so lovely, he's given us a spare clash finder so we don't have to buy one. Yay! <laughs> We're just chilling by the cave, waiting for graphic nature now. Um, but yeah, we're just doing that. I'm gonna try and get some photos as well with my long lens and see what happens. So we just finished watching Graphic Nature, we're going to head back to camp to have some food and a sit down and a chill for a little bit. Alright, we're back in camp now. Uh, 
fucking hate walking up that hill. Uh, but yeah, we're just <laughs> we're just cooking now, boiling some water for some pot noodle, and and have a bit of food before we go off. And, well, Charlotte's gonna have a nap, and then I'm gonna go out and do some work. What pot and pot noodle have you got? I have naked big eat high style fiery chicken penang egg noodles extra hot. Oh wow, that's a long long title. I just don't want your guys, your fans to miss any information. Yeah, and uh, I have some super noodles, barbecue beef. I very nearly got those tonight. Did you? <laughs> matchy matchy. <laughs> but yeah, that is what I'm having. Right, so Charlotte's gone for a nap, so I'm gonna head down to the press to do some editing. Thank you, vlog! So now I know where they're camped, so I can come back later. I fucking, I always do. <laughs> my Christmas babies was in my room for four months. I love the Christmas babies. And I worked in the course, I worked with Tom Haley, like Christmas season, with just me doing babies. What? I was like just behind there. Oh, There's like, there were four loos behind there. And yeah, I didn't vlog when I was in crash because it was a bit rude. Fair enough. Yeah. Oh, that was a big wee though. Like, fuck you. I was literally sat there and I was like, please fucking sort shit out because I need to wee. <laughs> so we've come back to camp again. Um, work, my main, main work today is all done, which I'm happy about. And yeah. We're just gonna chill now, um, till probably when we go, we're Chloe and everyone for Skin Dread. Um, Cause there isn't really much else we really wanna see today. So go up Skin Dread, but I'm gonna tell you guys now, we're having an early night because we're both shattered. And I'm not being funny, I'm 32 now. I can't be doing like, you know, 24 seven partying anymore. So we're gonna do another like early night again. Yeah, I got like a massive load of bin bags from Booker's because you can get like the extra, extra big ones. So I was like, roll. So I was like, I'll grab some of those. They'll do me for all festival season, and then I can give them to everyone. So that we can have a pink. Oh, 
progressed to an alcoholic beverage, which is an absolute cocktail strawberry spritz. It's alright. I'm not a massive fan of vodka, but it's alright. Mm. Mm. Right, we're gonna head off and go and see if we can find Chloe, Chloe, Rach and Chaz. See if they're at camp and go and join them for a bit. And uh, yeah, and then go see Skin Tread. Yeah. At least it gives us an easy way to get over to them. Hello! We've come back. This is Charlotte. Finder says 25 too, so we're not sure when they're on now. Hmm, gonna be interesting. Yeah, we'll find out in like five minutes or more. to run to the hills when you play with bullets down a pilot.
four. One, four. One, four. My hearing is so bad that I thought Charlotte had said painted her feet, not changed her jeans. Just why? Why? Yeah, my hearing's fucked. Play a game of are we gonna trip over the guy group? I'm fucking cozy now. Good. I'm still quite warm actually in this, which I'm really surprised at. But like I said, give it an hour and then I'll be fucking freezing my tits off. All right, we're heading down to meet with Chloe and everyone and chill at the camp for a bit. And then see where it goes from there. I'm not sure if they're going to see soft play. I know I don't really care, so I don't know what we'll do. But we'll see. We'll see. Do, do, do. Do, do, do. I saw you in the crowd, like Jimmy. Huh? I'm so glad we weren't doing anything illegal. Just I'll just cut it out. There's <laughs> still documentation. How's your illegal pizza? Um, very legal. The coke is almost indetectable. Undetectable. <laughs> Indescribable. Um, ah. English is not my first language. Very much so, like, autism. Getting inside, growing out. So many people start going. Oh, fuck me, yeah, you do have a... I was like, shut the fuck up! <laughs> and then I remember finding... <laughs> We're all fucked up, aren't we? I found the video yeah. like, on Facebook. I was like, oh, that was like five years ago. And yeah. I shared it. And then some random girl said, oh my fucking God, we put that there. And I was like, you have to tell me the story. She goes, no, we were just walking by, like, above. Like, you know, obviously, mm. like, Valley was like, in a yeah. Pit. She's like, we were walking by, and there was just a frozen chicken on the ground. And so you we fucking... And I, and I was there like, you have, well, obviously what happened next. And she's like, oh, we picked it up, and we were, we were drunk, and we had a laugh. And then one of our friends was like, guess what? And then like, like threw it over their shoulder <laughs> into the air, and it just must have fell into the pit that is Fallon Smoker. I, 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 and then I said to her, I was like, was this like five years ago, like on like a Saturday night at the end of the month? And she was like, yeah, it was like like 11 p.m. Saturday night, this month, this year. And I looked at like the date that I uploaded the video, I was like, it literally aligns perfectly. Oh my God. And I said to her, I was like, are you like fucking with me? Or is this genuine? She goes, no, we, we found it on the road and just thought it would be funny to pick it up and go, oh, oh, oh chicken. Yeah. And then one of our friends was like, <laughs> they threw it over their shoulder and it just vanished and they just like, went off about their lives. There is, there is an only <laughs> and slightly more that's my amusing event. version of voice, which is that there was some poor bastard in the fucking main smoking area just going, <laughs> What the? Uh, no, no, just, just all just there, just like, no. Um, no, I'm actually feeling good. No, I've not been out in a while, oh, yeah. and I've been a bit anxious, but no, I'm feeling really good about. <laughs> and it's just like, like so at which point you can call out a foul play. Oh, da 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 da. Oh, oh. I miss you, and also shut up. <laughs> right, I'm gonna pop to the bathroom. So I'll throw it all the way past. Yeah, I'm gonna use my toilet. 
<laughs> right, we've just been hanging with people and now we're heading back to camp and I'm not gonna lie, we're gonna get ready and go to bed. So, I'll see you guys in the morning. Good morning everyone. So, uh, it's about half ten now. I've just been chilling all morning and as you can see I've been getting ready. Unfortunately I don't wake up like this. And yeah, we're gonna go soon and go down to my mate's camp to meet up with them so we can go watch raptors. And then we're gonna go from there, I think. Uh, so yeah, the morning's been nice. It's been it's quite... I've realised that the side I always sleep on in my tent is the side that the sun hits every fucking morning. So like, it's about seven o'clock. If it's gonna be as warm as it was this morning, tomorrow, I'm gonna wake up at seven o'clock because the tent's just too fucking hot. So that's gonna be fun. Uh, but other than that, it's been good. Um, do you mind doing some braids for me? Yeah, sure. sure. What do you want? Because I can do like. I'm thinking. So I can do two full, like down the middle, full braids. Mm, or I can do them two I'm full ones, take all of this hair, mm. so you just have this bit pinned back. Or I can do two like little thin strips. I'm thinking two normal braids, normal, and then let the hair flow at the back. Okay. Does that make sense? Yeah. Yeah, so like half up, half down. My hair isn't brushed yet, so. Have you seen Anastasia? The movie? Uh, no, actually. It's one of those ones like, I'm all, like, it comes up in conversation. I'm like, man, I should really watch it. And mm. then I've never got around. Do you want to brush your hair? I'm scared of holding it. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm alright. I do not have a coat. We'll go down to the others and then hopefully they're all awake. <laughs> I don't know how late they all stayed out to be fair because I think they're all going like silent disco and stuff. So <sighs> we will find out. <sighs> at least at least we're all gonna go support raptors. Like <laughs> No? I, I can't shoot on camera because I might get banned from YouTube but there is quite a lot of arse next to me and it looks very very good <laughs> Which way are we going? Yeah. Yeah. To dry stuff That makes sense Yeah If your chair gets lost, come out Right, we're heading to Raptors. All I see is your ass, Chloe. <laughs> I'll take a photo and put it in the group chat when I go to the uh, press area and be like, look, Chloe's representing. <laughs> <laughs> and I just watch like everyone go. I can see two of my friends today. I need to keep an eye out for Charlotte. Oh, my bum, so I said for her to come here, but I don't know where she is. If we stay here, so she can at least see us. Yeah, she she's somewhere. She, I said, well, if we stay here, and then she can see me. What, Emily? I told her we'd be right here on the inside. No, uh, Charlotte. Oh, right. Yeah, she she's gone to the toilet to get tea, so I don't know where she. I said for her to come here. So if we stay here, then she'll be able to see us. Right, so we've managed to just run into Luke, which is quite nice. Uh, nice to have a little chat, a bit catch up. But uh, yeah, we've just got Raptors next. Finally. Just finished 
watching raptors and Charlotte has accumulated a balloon. <laughs> um, so we're gonna do, well, I'm gonna do boring content now for like Instagram and stuff. So go check out my Instagram, my TikTok to find out what's going on there. Um, and I'll catch up with you guys in a bit. Yay! <laughs> so I've just met a para called Dory. Is she okay to stroke or? Just on the forehead. Just on the forehead. Oh, she's adorable. I'm so happy. I love, I love, I love animals. So I'm like, oh my god. Big wings. Big wings. Big wings, man. Big wings. She's with you, she's doing now. I'll take the tree instead. <laughs> yeah. So um just being impressed for two hours trying to sort the shit out, which is really fucking annoying. Um but I've now come down to watch Pale Dust. I ran into Will from DS. He's not here for DS though. <laughs> which I thought he was. Uh, but yeah, we're gonna go watch the pale dusk and the tent is completely rammed for him, which very good. to get water, battery packs, and a lot of shit. So I'm gonna go see if Charlotte's at my at Chloe's camp, and then and then go and refuel. Right, no one was at camp, as in Chloe's camp. So I've come back to mine to have some food, drink because I am like I'm hungry as well. But I really haven't had a drink for quite a while, and it is really fucking hot. So I'm gonna have a drink now, sit and chill, and have a drink. And then go off and see what I can do. I don't know where Charlotte is. I'm hoping if she realises the messages haven't sent, I might be back at camp. I'm hoping. But yeah, I'm just gonna chill now for a bit. Oh yeah, I'll tell you one fucking dumb sh thing I did was using my lead to charge up my tablet. What happened? I fucking left it in press. Only just realised. I'm not sure I'm going to get it back. I'll have to go back later and see if it's still there. If it is, I'll be like, ah, uh, awesome. But if not, I've lost the lead and I have to buy a new one. <sighs> Shit happens. I'm having food. I managed to text Charlotte had some signal. And she's coming back here. She's just been in the forest. Um, I'm having food here. I'm gonna have perfect mash. Because I can't be asked to like cook anything more. And I just really need to eat because I've had a cereal. And I'm really bad for eating. Like at festivals, because I just get so distracted doing other shit. And then I'm like, shit, I need to eat. And then I'm like, I need to eat, I need to eat, I need to eat. And then it's like, and then I'll just keep forgetting. <laughs> Autistic brain as it is. So yeah. We're doing good. I'm just chilling, cooking food. Life's good right now. We're getting way too hot, so I made everyone go to um, forest stage. Mm. So we can sit under the trees. It's so fucking nice down there. I yeah. I don't blame you. Like I went when I went. To, I watched a little bit of Pale Dusk because mm. um, I have seen them before. I got like some shots and stuff of the vlog and stuff. Um, and then. Yeah, and then I went I went back and popped to their camp because I was like, oh, I'll see if they're there. And I was like, oh, no one's there. So I was like, I don't know where they are. And I was like, right, I haven't eaten since breakfast. 
Yeah. I'm really fucking thirsty. I was getting hungry anyway, so when you were like, I'm gonna get food, I was like, excellent opportunity. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna get some food. Yeah. And I was, yeah, because I was like, I haven't eaten, I need to get food. And then I was like, I also haven't like drunk anything mm. in a while. Oh, yeah, and I, I was like, water to fill up my water bowls. yeah, so I was like, I need water. I was like, I need water and I need to get some food. So I was like, yeah, that's fine. Like, this is actually really good. Is it? It's mm, good. Like, it was quite expensive, but like, a pink meal. Mm. It was like three quid or something, which was a bit like, Ugh. But I, was, like, I know when I'm like, what food? <laughs> like, porridge this morning if i'm not like interested i will just stop eating yeah and i know what i'm like so i was like i've got to have a few different flavors so mm. that i can try and entertain myself yeah because i am a child yeah that's what i try and do because like i've got like two i think actually i've got one all day breakfast then like the full monty one mm. and then also like with the mash because i do that the cheese so good i'm totally gonna try and find that the next time Oh. Have to take the work. Oh. Bacon. Yeah. Uh, Sainsbury's I got this at. And it's Idaho brand. But yeah. Yeah, no, I saw it. It was in it was in the same section you get like smash and all of like the pot noodles and stuff like that. And I saw it and I was like, that's a really good fucking idea for festival. My original idea was to do this and then do a tin. But I was like, I can't be fucking asked to cook like a tin. I just want I'm definitely gonna join you my all day breakfast tomorrow for my last mm. day. Oh yeah, very excited. I've rehydrated, we have both refueled, and we're now gonna go down to the forest to go meet up with everyone else. Hide from the sun. Yes, and hide from the sun. Oh, we've just entered the trees and it is so nice. Maybe this is where the 2000 trees are. <laughs> yeah. by a beer or a wolf. It was flying like right close to my mouth and I moved my mouth really quickly and then it stuck me. I'm not allergic so that's fine. We're heading back to the other camp and we're gonna chill for a bit. Charlotte's gonna go have a social battery recharge. <laughs> the little ears. Oh, they look so funny. I thought they were going to be like where your ears are, not on top of your head. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. To be fair, like, even though this looks like really burning, like, it's not sensitive at all. Like, it feels fine. My head's a bit sore. This bit over here is kind of everything else is fine. At least when I do it for a sunflower, I'm doing it. 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 I'm doing it.
me see if I can get it back. Because I've, I've lost a charging cable. So we're going to go do that now. And then I um, can use the toilets backstage. And then I can go back to see the other guys. I don't even fucking check my wristband. Ostriches of corkscrew penises, oh, and it actually yeah, comes out as well. Like, 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 like various yeah. animal thingies. Yeah, like dragon dildos. Yeah. Not, real, not real animals. Well, they got, yeah, they got big tentacle ones. Can you say so the dragons are real? Uh, yeah. Can you say dragons are real? Komodo dragon. Have you ever been to Wales? <laughs> <laughs> It's on the flag. I think it's the real. Welsh flag is. The and best a unicorn's real as well. It is a cool flag. So hardcore. <laughs> Just very pale. Get your nipple out! Like they are, it's like, get your no, nipple out! Said no to seeing like, my nipple, how, so it's staying cream. away. You're like, like a cream color. Get your nipple out, and then I'll put like a little smiley face oh, over it. Is everyone ready to see <laughs> my tits? Like, everyone's had a few more drinks. It's time. Cross it, idiot. Yeah, you need to let Charlotte braid your hair. Relive our emo youths. Whoop whoop. Man, we serve church. Canterbury's currently playing sabotage, so we turned up at the right moment. Oh, I got a big old sneeze. I needed it. Bullet for my fucking Valentine. Everybody have guns about us. We're there like. Hello. We're the cool kids. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Someone fucking hanging on 
Everybody help me make it better Not gonna lie, I'm fucking shattered. Bullet were fucking sick. I'm so happy that they played like a load of old stuff. And they even brought out like Cancer Bats to Axe Wound, which really fucking good. Never thought I'd see that live. So yeah, really happy. We're just chilling at the minute. We're gonna make some food. Hopefully I have some food, I'll feel a little bit more alive so we can pop down to the silent disco for a little bit, just to check it out. But we shall see. It might be bed, and then I'll see you guys tomorrow, but we shall see. I don't like my jeans, as I cannot put my phone <laughs> in my pocket. I don't have pockets. I can try and which I might. Okay. You don't have any pockets whatsoever? Nope. Oh, don't worry, I'm gonna just do what that. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, we are heading to the silent disco um, to check it out for a bit. Probably won't stay out too long, but we're gonna go check it out anyway. See what the crack is. And now you just hear the mix of like all yeah, the channels singing a different. <laughs> So it's a, it's a kind of cloudy morning, which hasn't been too bad because it meant that you could get a lion. But oh my fucking god, I am tired. I think I always didn't go to bed till about half one, two. I then woke up about 3 a.m. for my 3 a.m. wee. And I went for a wee. And then because I was so tired, I stood up from my toilet and I stumbled so badly, I almost knocked over my toilet. I didn't, luckily, but almost happened. And I was like, Serena. But anyway. We, um, but yeah, we are currently cooking breakfast. I'm gonna have some breakfast and then 
I don't know what we're gonna do. Wake up a bit more. I need to check, we need to check the bands. I don't think there's anything on really early. I think the first band's at like two. So we've got like time to do stuff. So we're doing good. Yeah, the, the beans and the sauce will sizzle a lot quicker. Um, but you just gotta kind of stir it a little bit just to make sure it doesn't stick to you. It will still stick though. So uh, we've progressed into the tent because it started raining. So we have now come and hide in the tent. I'm currently eating my food. There is my food. And uh, yeah, I'm hiding from the weather now. I'm, I don't think this tent has had a really good test of how it's waterproof or not. Or how waterproof it is. It'll be fine. raining just a little bit harden up my door yeah so this is officially an all kind of standard festival like, we didn't get any rain to download and slam dunk so it's kind of overdue <sighs> yay but what I'm going to do while it's wet, I'm going to continue doing my morning routine and getting ready and then, yeah, and then just do all of that, basically. So the rain has subsided for now, so I'm going to start getting ready, do my makeup and hopefully, fingers crossed it will hold up so I can go and shoot my content for today um, and then go get that all done so it's ready so I haven't got to kind of do any more work, well obviously vlog but no more work so we're going to do that now finally. Let's get some tunes on, get the party going that. Right, we are ready for the day. Uh, we're gonna go pop by Chloe's camp to go say hi to everyone and make sure they're all okay. See how they enjoyed the rain. You're gonna just check that. Um, but yeah, we're gonna go do that and then we're gonna go shoot some content. Also, Jesus is coming down today. So hopefully run into him and hopefully he's wearing his trees as gear and then it'll be easy to spot. Oh, some people have left. Hello. 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 It's always a miracle and it's like, oh, we have pockets and outfits. I don't know how they found my drugs. Like, they're in my pockets. It's like... what, Rachel, what you need to do is put like loads of awkward shit in there. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I just walk around with them just to see what people say. Walk around with How do they know? Fashion. Fashion. The one bad thing about this coat is a fucking sweat box. I've just been impressed to do content shit. Uh, now I'm heading up for Electric 6 who just started. Hope to meet people at the tree side.
All right, I'll come back to camp again because I need to eat because I haven't eaten since breakfast and I'm fucking starving and I need some food. Um, and then we're gonna start packing up some stuff because uh, Charlotte's leaving tonight. So I'm gonna pack up some stuff to do my thing, but we're gonna eat first. And I can't, f that fucking walk from the main arena up here, this, that hill is fucking horrible. Ugh, I fucking hate it. I was gonna have a pot noodle, but then I decided, fuck it, I'll have some ravioli instead and use up my tins because they're heavier than pot noodle. So, we're having some ravioli. And my nose is itchy. So I'm not sure if it's because of the wind or if they've turned up the uh, sound on the main stage, but I can hear holding absence from here. Pretty good. Also, mini land cookies. So good. Right, we are pretty much packed up, which is good. And we can do a run, hopefully we won't miss Daffabana. Right guys, we're all packed up and we're doing my my one trip and then taking all the Charlotte stuff back to the car. And Def Havana have already started playing so we can hear them while we're doing our doing our trip. Ugh. We're almost there. Fucking hot and sweaty. I do, I do have a water can with me, because I was like, I'm gonna need it. My makeup's probably coming all the way off. Is that my baby? Yeah, that's my baby. Oh, I've missed you. So much carry for the keyboard. Key, 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 key. Ooh. So um, we managed to get everything in the car and we sat down and then it started pissing it down the rain so we're now doing the sensible thing and sitting in the car while it rains and we're hoping that it kind of hopefully dies down a little bit in a bit so we can go back to the... <laughs> I, say <laughs> I say that! Why I'm would you say it. that out loud? You summoned it! I haven't got any wood to touch. just gotten heavier but yeah we're gonna sit out the rain hopefully and then take the trolley back it's a shame i'm not a boy because i'm like you can touch my <laughs> yeah you're really all risky in the car oh <laughs> <laughs> uh, shame on no spaces further down otherwise i'll just drive the car further down and it's just like nah it's not worth it just in case joe comes to the top of this car park yeah so we're still sat in the car because we decided it was too wet and so and by the time we walked up to the back to the camp to drop the trolley off we were going to come back for Charlotte to get her lift so we're still sat in the car and it's continually raining and we've also heard thunder and we've seen lightning so I'm glad we're in the car right now so uh, hopefully I don't get struck by lightning I just hope my tent's okay <laughs> yeah oh, all my stuff is in like where it's like double skin anyway so it will be fine i'm just like i'm like oh god did i oh you know you do that thing where I'm like oh god did i zip it up and i'm like no i did zip it up so i did that before we got ready right we're finally going back to well i'm finally going back to camp charlotte is going i'm sad i'm gonna be all on my own i know <laughs> but still i've got to wake up on my own not have me staring at you like 7am, yeah. like, morning! And I'm like, fuck off! <laughs> but yeah, we're gonna go back to camp and then probably gonna go find Chloe and everyone. See how they're coping with the rain. And then I don't know what I'm gonna do. We're gonna find out. So I'm a hot, sweaty mess, but I made it back to my tent. It's all okay. I'm sad Charlotte's gone. 
but I'm gonna have a quick chill and stuff. And then I'm gonna go see if I can find Chloe and people. And if not, I'm just gonna have to wander around and stuff. Like, you know, just kill the last bit. Like, at the minute, it's just too fucking wet to set down my tent and go tonight, so. Hmm. Right, I'm heading down to see if Chloe and the others are at their camp. And, uh, yeah. Gonna go see if I can find them. So I have people to hang out with. It's flooded and wet. So, everyone behind me, like three meters of people behind me, was just in puddles, just like. It, oh, because, fuck. You, because it came in so bad. Mm. Why the fuck is I'm nosy. Ah, uh, no. Oh, okay, it doesn't She just locked us in. <laughs> yeah, no, literally. Yeah, because yeah, yeah. we were sat in the car and we could obviously see how hard it was going down, and we were like. Yeah. And, and then she was sat there and we were like, yeah, we're glad we didn't go watch Death of Banner now. Yeah, probably. Yeah, my God, my mate. So it wasn't raining when he left, yeah. but I was like, I was going to go watch it with him. But then I was like, actually, nah. And then like, obviously it happened like, yeah. Yeah. Uh, no, I just, I just don't want to get wet. My, luckily my tent's okay. I think the, the, the only thing that got a bit moist was my toilet box. I bring a portable toilet. Oh, no, no, no. I've got a port portable toilet. It's the box that it goes in. I have a portable toilet. Yeah, what do you think after that? Yeah. So she didn't think she might come get me. I'm sorry, I thought they were going to come back. I that's think why I'm annoyed by it. If I wasn't camping with my boyfriend, I'd probably like... Yeah. Okay. That's, that's why I'm annoyed. I don't think anyone could judge me. I was like, this is when it was sunny. Yeah, so... Are you filming the whole thing? That's a quadruple. That's a quadruple. That's a quadruple. That's a quadruple. That's a Wow, she slapped his ass, it, but it slapped the can and didn't realise it was there. No one, no one it was a slow clap, like. <laughs> 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 got my camp lights, keep my lights. So, come back up to my camp so I can make my pot noodle. I can smell the hexi burner in the fire. Yeah. Like, taking me back. And, it's, and, and we've got a little, steps. I'm basically using my hexi burner, so we've got a little fire going as well. Nice. So I can boil my water. And I'm going to have pot noodle, have some food, and then make my hot water bottle as well. And then we're gonna get a bit of water. I'm gonna grab a jumper and then we're gonna go waiting around for raptors basically. Oh, and also, with in the darkness, there you go. There's Chaz. He's coming and join me because Charlotte's not here. No, you don't want to be alone. Charlotte, where are you? Yeah, like I I rolled over to the other side of my like sleeping area and just lay on the floor for a bit because the floor was still cold. And I was just like, yep, that's great, that's yeah, great. Yeah, but yeah, like, but then I didn't realise I woke up at nine this morning. Because yeah. um, I think I went to bed for like an hour and then I woke up at three for my wee. And then I went back to sleep and I didn't realise I didn't wake up till about nine. So I woke up and I was like, oh, what's the time? And then I was like, and then they were like, oh, it's 9 a.m. And I was like, oh, shit, I better get out. Char Charlotte had been awake and she, and, I sh and she heard me get obviously get out of tent. And she was like, oh, you're awake. And I was like, yeah. And she was like, I was tempted to just come and come and wake you up. <laughs> Let's see if the Raptors guys are there now. It's starting in like this. Well, that's Frabbit there. Yeah, but it's over that way, isn't it? No, that literally, that is it. Oh, like in this thing? Yeah, that's it. Wait, that's when they're playing? Yeah. Oh, I think they're playing. Oh, yeah. Yeah. yeah, no. Frappet stage. Oh. Literally oh, there. Stage. Yeah. yeah. Oh, there's, 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 yeah, no. That's literally it. Have you seen the We are the ones that wanna play, always wanna go, but life feels a waterfall. Swing from the river and you swell around and put up a wall. <laughs> 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 Good morning, everyone. It's Sunday morning and it's time to leave trees. 
I'm not gonna lie, I slept like fucking shit last night. Um, did Raptors acoustic set, which was kind of funny. And it was good as well. Funny but good. Um, had to shout that play Wonderwall. Um, that finished about 12 and then I think I got back. I think I went to bed about half 12, I think. And then I just couldn't fucking sleep. Partly because I needed to pee all the fucking time. Like, literally, pee when I got back. An hour later, I needed to pee again. And then I went to sleep. And then I woke up like 10 to 6. So, you know, four or five hours. No, yeah, about four and a half hours sleep. I woke up at 10 to 6, I needed to pee again. Then went back to sleep for a couple hours. And I was like, better get out because. So we need to go. So yeah, like I haven't got too much because I did a lot of my stuff yesterday. I haven't got too much. I need to pack down. It's just the effort to do it. But I'm gonna get through my routine and do my face and everything. And then yeah, we're gonna we're gonna soldier on. Goodbye home. You've been good to me. Right, we are packed up and we're going to start the long mooch to the car. I say long, it's just going to take me a while to pull everything because uh, I'm doing this on my own. So, but I'm going to pop by clothes camp and see if anyone's still there or if they've left. So, we're going to do that first and then we're going to start the walk to the car. Chloe and everyone have all gone. I can see the empty space. So I'm gonna head back to the car. Hopefully this thing won't tip over. Yeah, probably will at one point. But this is the easy bit because this is kind of mostly downhill. It's the last like third of the journey that's gonna be a pain in the fucking arse. So we wanna enjoy the easy times. hardest bit is done which is that fucking hill I fucking hate it oh, honestly trees why the fuck did you move the car park it used to be so fucking good but yeah the hardest bit is done I'm gonna have a break and then I'm gonna take it one step at a time because we've still got hills but not as bad as that one so we're just gonna take it. I tried to tiptoe once, and that was on the bumpy ground and the walk through the forest. Like, I knew it would do it, and it's probably gonna do it in a second when we go around one of the corners where it's really bumpy and stuff. So I'm gonna have to see what I can do. But we're not too far. We're not too far now. Hill. I know on camera it doesn't look that steep, but if I flatten this, like, so fucking steep. <sighs> Made it. Made it. <sighs> right, we're setting off. And it's currently 11.26. So, it took three and a half hours to get into Slumdunk. I don't know how long it's going to take to get out of here. We shall see. Hopefully not too long, but everyone's leaving now, so... We shall see. Two hours it took me to do what should have been a 20 minute journey to McDonald's. It took about an hour to get out of the car park from trees and obviously get on back onto the, the main road. Then I was also just kind of stuck in other traffic. Overall, not too bad if I'm comparing to kind of other festivals that have already happened this year. I got home at about half two and God, I was shattered physically, 
mentally and socially, but it was worth it. Trees was so much fun. I love how small it is and coming to it off the back of how busy Download and Slam Dunk have been this year, it's great to feel like you have some space to relax and breathe. As an autistic person, I do always feel a bit calmer at Trees and that is partly to do with less people and more space to be able to hang out rather than constantly be in a crush of people. Even when I was at the main stage in the middle, I still had room and wasn't squashed. It was great. I went with my friend Charlotte. It was her first trees and festival and it was a great experience. We haven't known each other long, but we have become friends and it is great to hang out and get to know each other even more. It actually felt weird on Saturday night when she had left and I was camping on my own. I was a little sad actually. Signal is always an issue, but with how small the area is, I managed to run into majority of people that I knew attending. And it was great to see some old friends who I haven't seen for years for catch up which was amazing, but also seeing newer friends and joining up with them for the majority of the festival. I only saw a handful of bands, but with trees I never feel like I miss out. I go more to see friends, hang out and see what happens, rather than worrying about seeing bands. I feel like this festival is more than just the music. It was also great to be attending on a press pass this year. I've been going since 2014 and I didn't think I'd get a chance to experience doing press for myself. It was so much fun to be able to work on content and have access to post daily, Wi-Fi dependent. Also having a chance to network and see photographer and interview people in the press area and have a chance to hang out and talk. Of course things aren't all sunshine and daisies. My main negatives are the walk from the car park. It isn't that far, but that hill is a pain to get up and down especially with all of your stuff. It is a struggle for everyone. Then the road from Sassy made it quite muddy and not easy to walk on the already uneven ground. Definitely something to improve for next year. It was so much easier when we parked right next to the campsite. But the negatives are smaller than the positives. I hope you enjoyed these thoughts and my vlog. Please remember to like this video, comment fave memory of trees, and also subscribe for more festival content. Thank you for watching and see you all next time. Bye.